So for people who have not studied chemical engineering or who have not been familiar with what chemical engineers do, the range of tasks that are carried out by chemical engineers are too numerous to, to mention. However, with a chemical engineering background, one takes a product from the scientists in a laboratory environment, which is almost always on the smallest of scale, beaker size. And they have to turn it into something on the scale of a, a, a drum of 250 pound size. And then they have to take it to another level so that everybody in a state of, say, New Jersey can use it. And then they have to even go beyond that and take it to a, a level where the entire country and to even a level where the entire world. And also, this process had, has to be duplicable. In other words, if we make a product in the United States at certain conditions and certain uh, uh, quality, that has to be translated in other countries the same way so that the same product is made. And so this is where chemical engineers shine. This is where they take a product from the lab or a process and develop it into a scale that everyone can use it and everyone can have their own version of it in various sizes, shapes, and colors for that matter. And if we want to, we can vary it in, in other ways. But the science background required there is chemistry, the physics, and all the math. And nowadays, biology, because we're combining the usual chemistry with biology to make products that are more closer to animals and plants. And this helps us to look at our environment in a different light and how we want to maintain and sustain that. And again, chemical engineers are going to be in the forefront of that because when we talk about carbon capture, chemical engineers are going to have to develop the equipment and the process because the labs will come up with some of the methods. But there are always some problems that are on a lab scale that may appear to be so small until you try to make this larger product, then those small problems become a little bit larger and thereby try to prevent the process from happening and chemical engineers are the ones who have to figure that out and make it work so that everyone can have a nice life and enjoy the planet the way it should.